Welcome back. The Russians are coming. Two of them. Four to go. And here's the young lady in second place after the short. Elena Radianova. Music from Rachmaninoff. Should have been a triple toe at the end of that combination, but she didn't feel she could do it. Triple flip. thinking that time the triple Lutz with the triple toe loop at the end Absolutely no setup time into the spin at all. It'd be a level five spin if there was one. Triple loop, triple salco, but. Uncertain landings on both. I'm not sure she was round on the second, the final part, actually, of that uh, combination. Axel was good. Yes, it's not the fluent Radionova we've seen all year. Rather sketchy. Dazzling spin at the end. High octane routine, but really for the first time this year, she looked vulnerable. It's been a long season. It's been a long, but particularly for the Russian girls, they've they've done loads and loads of events, and it's been very, very intense. And I, and there's to me, I don't see many breathing points in that routine at all. It's all go. And in the past, she's maintained all go right the way through. The level of in, in, of that intensity she's able to do. But here, there was there was a bit of a question on that. Very.
very good on the beginning. The Lutz didn't work with the toe loop afterwards. She would have practiced to have it scheduled in later on, but did it and delivered. So that really to admire. A question on the edge of uh, the takeoff for the flip. The, the step sequence was, uh, was, was okay. Some of the spins were just superb. Doubled out on that triple loop, of course, so mistakes in there. Behind the scenes, we understand the word is that she's not been well. She may have picked up a bug, and that would have added to any incremental tiredness that she's had. Well, this is a routine that uh, will <laughs> bite you if you're not completely well because it requires full-on energy, which is what we've seen from her. And there are moments in it, well round on that, there are moments in it, the start, beautiful grace and artistry really fitting with the music, but that was a little bit in and out. The preparation for the jumps, losing some of that feel for the music. It's all incremental, but at this level, it makes a difference. This is a young lady who won both her Grand Prix events in the uh, Skate America and the Trophy Bomba, just beaten in the Grand Prix final, but is she going to hang on to a podium place here? Yeah, so that Salka was under-rotated. Again, she's got a good cushion in front of the likes of Gold and Wagner. But uh, only two marks in the front of uh, Miyahara. Miyahara may go past her here. So we'll have to see where she is. Yeah, get the tracksuit top on. There is Miyahara. Anxious moments for her. Still three to go. Is she still going to be number one? No. Yes, she is. Radianova drops down to second place. So she's going to have a nervous time now. Three more to go. But it is Miyaharu leads for Japan.